<laughs> so, Steve Mack and up and died on us. Um, and what it made me think, aside from all the thoughts about Steve himself, which were many, is that he would have said, you know, Martin, everybody here is going to die. Mm -hmm. Everyone in this room is going to die. Everyone out there is going to die. It's just a matter of time. Don't worry about it. <laughs> worry about what you're doing while you're here. And Steve did a lot. I can hear him say that. While he was here. So, I figured the best thing I could do is give you more Steve. <laughs> this is a poem by Steve Mackin called Four Moons. I saw four moons, one upon each window, each twisted by cheap glass, all the illumination needed to silver dark empty streets, ashy cement, asphalt pitch which could not see or be seen by the moon, such is the nature of mirrors. Moon splashes off the windows to pool upon the sidewalk where she did tread lightly. Oh, bright moon, lifeless bone, scarred, airless, no light of your own, turning shadows into milk or snow. So light her footfall, so light are you, the impression she leaves holds no memory of her shade. She's not immortal, simply fatal. Softer than flesh, harder than maker, she'll massage you with nettles, tender emotions I tried to sucker. Made of moonlight upon the ocean, she scoured with imagination. Oh, moonlight upon the ocean, white path to the horizon, I'd follow you, but my soul is heavier than your glimmer across her massive water. And drowning is too easy. Rather let it be murder to be pushed into a pyre, caressed by love's live coals, to scream in agony of light, metamorphosis, brilliant, martyred. Moon, I lost you to ashes. O oh, moon upon the window, O oh, moon upon the ocean, O oh, moon upon the martyred, O oh, moon, you barren stump. <laughs> mm -hmm.